Hi, so I'm gonna show you the difference that some really great lighting can make. So when you're getting your color match done, as you can see, I have some hover headlights in the background. You're not gonna really want that, but thankfully I'm in the afternoon sun and they're really not gonna throw my colors off a whole lot. So do you see how my face is all nice and illuminated? There's no shadows on my neck, right? So we need to see your whole face. It's actually best to take your glasses off. So we need to see your whole face underneath your eyes, your neck and your chest to get a really good photo. So obviously if I turn my face, I'm still standing here in front of the window, but if I turn my face sideways, you can't see my whole face and half of my neck. So that's not really a great photo for us to color match with. The other angle is obviously not super great as you can see. So now I'm turning sideways. Um, so I'm holding my camera um, parallel to the window and I'm facing parallel. Again, so here the camera's still in the same spot but I'm looking forward so we're missing half of your face and we can't actually get the right color match either. My husband's laughing at me taking a video. Um, so now this is me facing the window or sorry, facing away from the window with my body and holding the phone. Also, this is not a good angle for me, but you can see that my face is really shadowed. I'm really not loving this. That is not a great angle for me. Yikes. So that is the difference that actually having a really great um, color match photo can bring. So here I'm going a little bit away from the window and as you can see, my color is changing. I'm getting um, a little bit lighter here and I'm walking towards the window. I'm gonna be about two or three feet away and look at how warm my colors are in comparison. So that's why it's really important to stand just that two to three feet away from the window with your hand right in front of you facing the nice bright sun. So we don't want to be in direct sunlight. And I'm also going to show you something else. So if you are going outside and taking a photo, look at how my color changes. No, it's super windy today. But look at how my color changes and how it's so different. That's why we really can't use an outside photo. And if you're in the bright direct sun, it's also going to give you weird colors. So just make sure that when you're sending us your color matches that you're facing the window, you're two to three feet away, and we will get the best color for you. All right, now just for fun, I'm gonna go show you what happens when you have overhead lighting on. So I'm going into my bathroom. Now I'm gonna be standing right in front of a window. That's actually pretty good lighting, right? I'm gonna go over here, I'm walking back and forth, and turn on my overhead lighting. Very different, right? Even if I'm standing here, look at how my lights changed and how my skin has changed. So that's why you want to make sure that your overhead lights, those lovely bathroom lights or dining room table lights, that they're shut off so that we get really good colors for you.